Some people have the misconception to believe that worshiping Allah Azza wa Jal is to go into one masjid, sit there 24 hours, seven days a week, and do dhikr. And this is not worshiping Allah Azza wa Jal because you need someone to feed you. You need someone to take care of your children and family. You need someone to take care of the community. So what's your role in that? I'm worshiping Allah Azza wa Jal. No, you're not. You are a beggar. We call it in Arabic shahat. You wait in the masjid for people to put their hands in their pockets and give you money. And you say, Alhamdulillah, you have this 1,000 long prayer beat. 1,000? Isn't this a little bit too much? So said, yeah, I'm making too much dhikr. Who are you counting it for? Are you counting it for Allah? Allah knows everything. He will not miss one count. Are you telling yourself about it? Then you're crazy. You don't know what you're doing. This is showing off. Subhanallah, subhanallah. You don't need to count. Do it without any numbers. But when you do it like this, you're showing off that, listen, look at me. I have these 1,000 prayer long beads, and this is for making dhikr I'm a righteous person. What is worship then? How can we worship Allah? Akhi, in order to know and understand what worship means, it is a word that includes everything that Allah loves. Anything that Allah loves and is pleased with, both of words, rhetoric, and deeds, both open and hidden, this is considered to be ibadah. By this definition, when you go with your spouse, take her out for dinner, intending to please Allah Azza wa Jal, this is a form of worship. When you drink a cup of coffee or tea, when it's 1 or 2 a.m. so that you become stronger to pray tahajjud, drinking coffee or tea is a form of ibadah. When you are kind to someone who's lost and you guide them for the sake of Allah, this is a form of ibadah. So being positive in your community is a form of ibadah. Helping others is a form of ibadah. Not only limited to prayer, fasting, and giving zakat, which is or which are one of the pillars of Islam, but rather expand this a little bit further.